here. There's this left hand side of five. Not ideal, and he's not got it there, and this hasn't finished yet. That's why you don't want to miss it left at five. I think another thing as well is when you're running around these bunkers, it's not going to happen here, but you've got to make sure when you walk in, you don't make a mess of the bunkers, because if you don't get it out and it comes back in there, you've created more harm for yourself. Yeah, because they're so small, you can get it just past the flag, but it's almost an impossible flag today. Any minute now, he'd light up a cigar, I think. And I may have to watch it for prints this time. Yeah, you know, we were making a point earlier about Tommy Fleetwood hitting it into 45 feet long and right there and his disappointment, and it's the right play with this flag. It's such a dangerous one. It's the only way. To, you, 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 it's actually better to miss it in the rough on the right-hand side. You just open up the green. You don't want to get too far past because you have a problem there. You don't want to miss it left. After breaking the back of the hole with the drive, Garcia has this for a par. yard second shot in here slightly down now to the left it was probably a seven iron may well have been an eight into this par five now he's facing seven maybe more can't get quite animated in bunkers let's hope he is able to control his emotions here that is as good as you can do even less now bogey pot for garcia at five just like Garcia was having a frustrating day, not least in this greenside bunker on the 13th. 